Hey everyone, welcome back to Minecraft. As I told you guys, I was going to be working a lot off camera. And we so far have a little bit done. Separate it out so I have some more stuff. He somehow got into my house, so now I have a pet fox. Yeah, I know you guys already saw this. <clears throat> After, um... And I will have it up later, just not right now. This is part of the stuff I use to make these few things, and you'll notice a lot of land has been cleared. But before I do that, you'll see I planted a lot more trees, flattened all this shit out. There, we still have our little garden over here. We uh, also, right here, have a lava pool. So that way we can throw away shit. Here's the mine. You go straight down. And because it's just started, just started. And here's the sad thing. I have been in here, in here so much. And look, there are just areas that are just completely just... Holy shit, they're all fucking... Yeah, they're just rail tracks and all that. And it's not just there. It's also down here. This allows me to get to either a lower part of that of the system. Or I don't even know. All I know is that there is a shit ton more up here. That I have to explore. Also along this side, there's even another part right here. With emeralds. Yeah, there's a bit more over this way that we'll have to clean out. But then we keep getting down lower and lower. We are at the 12th parallel. We are going in a straight motherfucking line. So this took me a good part of an afternoon to do. Along with recording. This just shows you guys what I've been working on. And then we'll go around and do a few other little things. If you guys remember we had that pool that was over here. I made it so I could go swimming in it. Very quick. Very easy. Come to one end and then up the stairs. As you can see we flattened a good portion out over here. I still want to get rid of that. Him, get rid of more of this, and get rid of this mound as well. Along with either filling this part of the cave in, or doing something. Also over here, I've been digging up a lot of the land. I'm thinking coming up to here, because as you can see, if I want to, say, bring it all the way up to the house, I'm going to either have to put a pair of stairs in, or something. But, drop down... I'm still working out here. As you can see, there's still natural stone in the ground. But then you guys see I'm making this into a four-quadrant tower. With all the digging I started doing, I don't like carrying a lot of this uh, decorative stone around. And when I was working on him, I had extra stone. So I did this. Because this is to get me from my home. To, I can easily open the door. Walk right through with the staircase on one side. This tower is among the same line as the uh, regular smooth stone tower. Because they're all going to look kind of like this. They already look like that at the base. The only difference is at the back of this one there's a door. That's it. Along with that, we have another wall. It's a small wall, but gets the job done. Along with a step down. So I can come in here and uh, explore this cave and see what I can do. Gotta be a little careful so I don't fall. And over here, next to this one, 
because I wanted something that's a light source. So if I go out into the ocean, I have some a beacon pretty much, and I'm also gonna put one out over there or up there. I made ourselves like normal a fishing area. So I cleared out a big area. There's another mine there. Quick tree for whatever I need. I'm inside. I got several extra tools and glass, fishing rods, more stone, but yeah. And then, of course, the pier. Allowing us to get a good ways out into the water. And as you can see, this whole back side is completely bare. I want to add some stuff over there. Now, in, I want to say episode 117 or 118, I don't remember which. Uh, you got, I remember telling you guys about the Bane of Cletus. One sec. Sorry if you guys heard that. Diet, I mean, Coke Zero, Cherry Vanilla. But because of a guy named Cletus, he's my good buddy, Ed. And I will be issuing him an apology for what I com I threw. I was cruel after I watched. I watched it recently. I'm like, I'm not taking it down, but it's like, oh, buddy, I was cruel. So with night coming on, I might spend the night over here. But uh, Ed, and there is an episode, and that will be one of these episodes later on with a rant or a podcast on it. Yeah, the thing goes all the way down that way. Ed decided, I want to play Minecraft with you. I want to play Minecraft. So, I made this fence. Except for over on his area. This, which I have du dubbed Castle Skull, is Ed's creation. I had to fix it over there, but he liked doing something stupid. I'm going to come to the edge. He liked jumping down, literally jumping and going down into the river. Except beforehand, before I cleaned it up, there was land down there. So I'm making it so he's not going to keep killing himself. So there is that. Plus he decided to start breaking up the stairs and over... Yeah. He's a, I want to say a destructo builder. He'll build something, the moment he doesn't like it, he wants to blow it up. Or if he doesn't like the game, he starts wanting to destroy everything in sight. But because this is my world, he's not allowed to do that. So instead, I, get, I removed his abilities of mining up bricks, of killing animals, of opening pen doors... Because that's one thing, one of the reasons why I was so pissed off at him. When he finally got so bored of Minecraft when, during the Bane of Cletus, mm -hmm. he was running around just opening all the doors. My animals mm -hmm. going everywhere. He would punch up all my crops. He, un he knows this is a game. We all know this is a game, but at the same time, he th doesn't know. Huh. Nightshader put a lot of time into this game. He put his heart and soul into building everything. But now, now we're going to try and be like, Okay, buddy, you build on your shit, I'll build on mine. Plus, as you guys remember, I had a lot of, I had an idea down here. And as you'll see... The uh, lantern idea was a good idea. But down here, I wanted it to be kind of like a workshop kind of thing. Plus a boat launch. Which it is. And I gotta make a sign out there. Because... Going down the river this way, we go to somewhere cool. I'm about to show you that. Going this way, we go out to the sea. So, I want to show you guys what's down the river this way. Because it actually took me and it took me a little bit to figure to finally get to be able to okay I'm gonna go down the river because here's something fun that I didn't know you guys will already see the trains already starting to change a little bit it switched over the oaks and birches really quick it's no longer just spruce and oak 
And what happens is it you'll start seeing more flowers. What happens is out this way, and there will be shit out here. Probably I'll move Ed out here. It's a birch and oak like flatland with flowers everywhere. It's like a flower flatland. And it's like huge. So with this uh, discovery, I told Ed, hey, there's more room and it, you'll be able to really, really push yourself. But uh, recently he just wanted to build and destroy, build and destroy. So I don't know how willing I'd let him, I'd be to let him back in this world. Just because all he ever wants to do is destroy or where's the TNT? Starts killing off all the animals, destroying the food. is like, bud, we're trying to do survival. Oh, I don't need to eat. Dies from hunger. It's like, what happened? You were hungry. You died from hunger. Oh, okay. Goes and does it again. It's... It's one of his flaws. He can't truly get into the game like everyone else. Like, you tell a lot of gamers, hey, you gotta do this to survive. Okay, we'll start making food, start killing animals and cooking the meat. Like, yeah. And the cool part is that looks like a keep entrance. And to that. So yeah, this is what I've been working on a little bit. So, and I haven't had as much time as I would have liked. Also, I've been working hard to build up the tower a little bit. Because that's going to be our beacon, like I said. And I've just been exploring without my map really quick. And hunting most of the time to get food. Chopping down trees. And, yeah, so... Wanted to give you guys just a little heads up on what's been going on. It's, this is going to be a really quick episode. A little 15 minute episode. Just telling you guys, hey, what's going on. And showing you guys, yep, that's us. Right in the smack dab of everything. Castle Grayskull off. Over that way. Which way is that? That would be northeast. Or would that be? Let me look. I take that back. That would be southeast. So we do have that. So he's southeast. And we have all these trees I can cut down. We have a very, very good uh, beef supply. As you just saw, we have enough. We have a mine now for good orb, which, as you can see from the the lanterns, from the weaponry, even my crossbow. We now have iron. Yeah, I'm still rocking leather armor. So, yeah. So, yeah. Not much else has changed. Like I haven't really found anything like in the game that we're going to do. I know um, one of the future episodes has to be... Uh, yeah, it has to be... me talking about Ed and Ed's experience in uh, Minecraft. Oh yeah, out this way is really cool. Flatland, but I can easily uh, tear it down and build it back up. And yeah, it all goes out to the sea. And there's even a lava downpour there, so I'm not exactly worried or anything, so yeah. Alright, so I'm going to head back home and call it an episode because there's not really much else to talk about Minecraft-wise. Unless I want to do a podcast, which is just me recording it, then talking about it. 
which is what I think the next couple episodes are going to be. Uh, episode 21. Well, this will be episode 21. I'll probably talk about Ed in episode 20. So, that way I can get that done, and then one episode will be just me fishing and talking over that. So, without further ado, I'm going to get head inside. Because we just hit the 15 minute mark. So, alright. Oh, someone come up with a name for uh, our new fox. So, thank you guys. I hope you enjoyed this little update. Yeah, it's not like a normal episode, but there's not really much for us to do besides explore and... That gets boring after a while, so thank you guys for watching. If you liked it, leave a like down below, subscribe today, and please remember, have fun playing in the dark. I'll see you guys in the next one. Night, y'all. AudioMicro.com